Anybody need some inside out gears made out of plastic? Hmm. Well, let's go uh, take a look at what Dave at Crafted Channel has made for us here. All right, everybody, welcome back to the old iron shop. All right, so here's these funny looking little things. It's kind of a rack that's curved sort of the wrong way for what you would think most things. But what this is for, and this is, this is really brilliant, I think. So typically if you're gonna take the chuck, and this is made special for the uh, Atlas lathes. Typically if you're gonna take it loose, what most guys will do is put their back gears in and that locks up the system, right? And you can pull on that and break it loose, change your chuck, all right? And you can tighten it up the same way. But when you do that, you've only got maybe one or two teeth engaged over here and these Zamac gears, uh, they can get broken pretty easy. Especially, let's say you got got a chuck that's stuck on there. Mine's in pretty good shape, and I don't ever put it on super tight. So, got two different ones. This one fits right here. And let me tell you what, that thing really fits nice on there. A lot of times it's difficult to get it to come off. There we go. See? <laughs> anyway, so you put that on there. And it jams into the headstock casting right here. Now you've got, I don't know, about 10, 15 teeth probably. See, you can take it loose. When you want to put it on, this will come over, bump against the, uh, the back gears on that side and keep it from returning. But you got a whole bunch of teeth engaged. And I'm pretty sure the plastic is probably good, would fail before the Zamac will, but shouldn't need to put that much pressure on there if you do the you've got other problems going on now i made two of them and that one fits amazingly well on there this one i'm not sure exactly what it's for it doesn't fit here although it does fit on this this back gear back here so maybe dave could uh, post in the comments what that's for but it fits really nice on there perhaps it's for a different model lathe i'm not 100 percent sure Anyway, I just want to thank Dave for sending these things to me. Man, they're really nice. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, please subscribe if you have not. And uh, definitely check out the videos that are coming up over here on the side. Uh, lots of interesting stuff always coming down the line. See you guys around.